Hello, everybody, and welcome to episode 127 of Animal Crossing New Horizons. In the last episode, we looked for the Golden Stag, and we failed. Along the way, we met Gullivar for the first ever time, and we helped him out, and yeah, hopefully we can get a new pirate item from him. Anyway, off screen, I encountered a Golden Stag, but I missed it. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, that was the first time I ever encountered a golden stag, and they are sensitive, which is one thing, that's how I scared it off, it's sensitive, but what really worries me is that's the first time I saw it! Yeah, anyway, today's birthday is Frida. Anyway, let's start. Yeah, Frida's a cool sheep. Anyway, oh yeah, I forgot. In this episode, we'll get his, we'll get uh, a pirate item from Gullivar, and we'll also uh, search for the golden stag some more. So yeah. Hello there, everyone. So yeah, I'm guessing Sahara's here today, cause like process of elimination. Right now on Jacktown, it's 6.47 p.m. on Thursday, July 16th, 2020. What I'm saying is, I saw in the plaza that nobody's here. And it, over there, and I know uh, CJ came this week, and Flick came last week. So did Red. So I'm by process of elimination, I've deduced that it is Sahara ca coming today. I kind of hope I'm wrong, because uh, I kind of hope like somehow Red comes again. Hmm, there really isn't any news to speak of today. Hey, did anyone else catch yesterday's cooking show? <sighs> the spiced Caesar salad they featured looked so delicious. Uh. I'm thinking about trying out the recipe myself tonight. Wish me luck. You know what else would be delicious? Getting to do my life instead of listening to island-wide broadcasts that are always the same. Oh, dear. Sorry, Isabel. Like, I feel like Pardon I've... I've Prattling on about my personal TV habits. Sorry, folks. Like, I feel like I've... Like, lately I've been a little harsh on Isabel. Sorry, Isabel. That's all for today. Mm. Have a fun day out there. So, yeah. Uh, ooh, I can't wait to see Gullivar's... Uh, the Gullivar item, I mean. Not Gullivar's thing. Oh yeah, I took off my lucky hat for some reason because I found, like I think, so, I, somehow I got this hat and I sold some stuff. Anyway, we have in the mail, Sky and Gullivar. Anyway, what sort of item did we get from Gull Captain Gullivar? <laughs> That's how he signed it at the end. Anyway, let's read Sky. Ah, I can just imagine hearing Sky. Read this. You know what, Shmoopy? Chores are boring and repetitive, but when I'm busy scrubbing away around my home, it's almost like a break. For a little while, I can get something accomplished without having to worry about anything. Know what I mean? Sky. No, I do not know what you mean. Anyway, Gullivar! What did we get? Pirate bandana! Yeah, look at that! Yeah, this is our first pirate item. I was kind of hoping we'd get a piece of uh, pirate furniture, but eh, whatever. Like this, this item is nice. It's it's neat and it's a uh, nice little. Yeah, I should probably not be saying anything bad about the pirate items, cause like uh, people are giving like are like um selling these for so much. So yeah. It's like a crime in Animal Crossing to say something bad about these now, nowadays. Oh right, yesterday I found some flowers in the dump and I decided to plant them here. It turns out those are the 200th flower that I've ever planted. Anyway. Speak, oh, a golden rose! And one of these, yeah, I've, I've watered my flowers. Uh. Yesterday. 
So yeah, I got some new stuff and the glass golden rose I needed for my special golden rose thing. Anyway, um, and there's another blue, which is cool, but not new. Yeah. Anyway, I also watered the plant, the flowers up here. Hopefully, we get a purple. No purple. Yeah. So up here, like um. Recently, I did a play date with my friend that got me the two fruits that I didn't have, and they weren't growing. So I decided. So I decided to move them in another place. Uh, in, the, in, in this place, so uh, they could grow, and then I'd put them back in my orchard, and it looks like it worked. Yeah, they weren't growing. Which is kind of sad. Oh, there's a, like, there's a, like, there's so many flowers all over my island that I just forget about. Like, that black right there, I like, I've, oh, yep, it's Sahara. Anyway, yeah. Ever since I found out that I couldn't get the fish wallpaper from her, I, I, I like, well, I think this is the first time she's, I've encountered her since, uh, we got the fish wallpaper. But yeah, I, I was trying to get this fish wallpaper. Then I found out I didn't need Sahara for it. <laughs> yeah, anyway, um... Right, the golden rose. Need to put that in its place. I'll get my... I don't need the shovel, but... You know what, I'm... I'm I'm, for some reason, I'm gonna put it out. I'm gonna, like, take it out anyway. Wait a second. If I pick all of my golden roses today... That might be beneficial. Anyway. So, yeah, I'm... I'm in this area, I'm trying to alternate between lilies of the valley and... Oh, I didn't even have to do what I could have just done it from the back. Whatever. Uh, anyway. Trying to alternate between lilies of the valley and... Golden roses. Oh, right, it's not grown yet, so I can't. So, yeah, a long time ago, I got a DIY for a uh, golden rose crown. So, yeah, I want that. And the cicadas outside, like, again, you can hear them through the door. Like, the door is closed, and you can still hear them. Anyway, I'm going to pick my golden roses anyway. Because if I do that, then I could just, uh, then I could, uh, build up to getting the golden crow the gold the golden crows the golden rose um crown which i which i want because it's the golden rose crown yeah so yeah it's the closest i could get to a royal crown before like uh like um the closest i could get for to a royal crown is a golden rose one because like the royal crown is like a million bells. I do eventually, you know what? I do eventually want to make one of, I mean, buy one of those with a million bells. Six golden roses. Yeah, if I, if I pick two of them, then I'll get one tomorrow. Okay, pick two of them. I mean, pick the other two over here. I'll get one tomorrow because the golden rose will grow. But then after that, Uh, I only need one more. So yeah, I'll, uh, you know what? I'll just place them all here. Because, like, you can place them in stacks. Yeah, I'm placing them all there. Anyway, now that all that business is done with flowers, let the hunt begin. So yeah, I've been looking for the golden... Like, I'm pretty sure this is, like, the third Golden Stag episode. Uh, yet. But there are, have been other episodes that I have not deliberately been looking for the, uh, Golden Stag, but I've still, uh, had a chance to find one, like the episode where I just looked for big palm tree bugs in general. Yeah, it's, it's definitely rare. Wait, why did I go to my Nook Miles? I didn't, I went to my D, I meant, I meant to go to my DIY, because I have a nude recipe. 
It's basically a bunch of logs on the floor. And I need eight pieces of wood. Yeah, like, that would be good. That, that You know what, that DIY, like... It's 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 good. Like so, just for a little like camping area, that would be that would be nice. As the real like another thing to like little set the scene, set the set the stage. I mean, like some firewood by a campfire. You know that that's nice. Anyway, what do we have here? We have a pink bathtub, a vacuum cleaner. And like a studio spotlight for the wall. I need this. Wait, what was it called? Studio wall spotlight. Wait, oh, I just noticed like, look at the little shells. Look at like the little shell wreath all over the, not wreath, uh. Wait, wreath, wait. I, I know there's an item. Um, like, there was a uh, bunny day item like that, so I want to see what they called it, so what I can call, so I know what to call that. Glowy garland, there, garland, a little uh, seashell garland. That's nice. Anyway, is there anything interesting here? I doubt it, but let's check. Uh, oh, we have all outdoorsy things today. Oh, then the shovel comes and like ruins that. <laughs> Whatever, uh. Anything really interesting? Not really. Oh, I wish there was something for the wall that could play music, because my downstairs aquarium is. like. musicless. Maybe every time we go down there, we have to sing. Just to make it so there's music. There, I could bring around my music player. Or I could just put it in one of the corners and. hopefully. Or I could just get rid of one of the fish, so so it could st we could still go around. You know what? Do I have any extra music players? Because I think I'm gonna do that now. Like get rid of one of the fish. It's sad, but like some of the fish I added, I added just to be there. So, that means there could possibly be like a black bass or something like that. Like, some of the, what I mean is like, some of the fish I added there aren't really good. They're just there to like, make the other fish feel better about themselves. So, so yeah, maybe I could get rid of one of those. Okay, like... I want to do it in the corner so it's not very obvious that one's missing. Okay, so who do we have in the corner? We have the Crucian Carp. We have the Sucker Fish. But, like, I had to, like, I, I ended up accidentally having two Blue Marlin, so... Yeah, I had to take one out. I mean, like, what I'm saying is there's one fish... One, uh, two wide fish still needed here. So, yeah, this is still the corner. Okay, suckerfish, crucian carp, dab, and dace. Well, there's only really one option for that. Like, suckerfish is kind of rare. Dab is cool. Cooler than the other. Some of the other fish. Dace and crucian carp. Are a little lacking though. Goodbye, Crucian Carp. Like, it has to go to the Crucian Carp. I mean, look at that. Like, the dace just looks cooler. Like, it has those red stripes, and, and the Crucian Carp is just gray. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. I, I had to do it. Like, this place is needs music badly. So, anyway. Do I have anything that plays music? I have a radio, but I think that's the closest I'm gonna get. Wait a second, I have an idea. Like, 
I need I need one brick fencing for this. Grab one. One brick fencing for this. But I think I think it's worth it. Anyway. Like, I have to make a sacrifice to be able to do it today. But you know what, there's a really some like a long time ago I put a radio in an area for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna pick it up, yeah. Like I put it right there. Like behind there. You see that? That's a radio. It's just there for no reason, really. I guess well well it's it will it's it's, it's, it would be better used in uh, the downstairs aquarium. I mean, like, like it's kind of weird and it's kind of bad because the villagers like to stand in front of it and sing. So it's like bad because like then they're in the way to get to my house. So yeah. Oh, what am I doing? I keep getting. I like. This is what happens in every pretty much every golden stack hunting video. I get distracted and I ended up end up not catching it. Well, I. Even if I didn't get distracted, I'd probably not catch it. But still, I'd probably catch it a lot faster. Anyway, there is one. Oh no, this is this is a this is something. Uh, oh, I have a solution. Like I was about to say, how am I going to turn the music on? But I just noticed I could do this, and then just turn the music on and then move it using decorator mode. Anyway, which song should we use? Ooh, look at this. It's an ocean song, but we also have uh, this song. Like, there are so many water kind of theme songs, like Aloha could count. Or it could just be a random song. I think I'm going with surfing. Surfing like the best. We did have to give up, a, give up a companion, the Crucian cart, but to be honest, he was pretty boring, so that's okay. <laughs> like a note to any people out there: like, don't give up your friends if they're boring. It like it's different. This is a video game. Like, they're not real fish. So yeah. Life lessons with Jack. Don't give up your friends if they're boring. <laughs> that has to be like, like the worst life lesson ever. Just because of like, like, I don't know. Like it's a good lesson, but like, <laughs> I don't know. Like it's a good lesson, but it sounds so weird. Don't give up your friends if they're boring. Anyway. What I'm doing now is I'm looking for my village crafting. Oh! Right. Like, we gotta do these daily chores faster. I mean, like, if I, if I want to do my daily chores, I shouldn't get distracted so easily. Oh, there's a new part of the daily chores that I forgot. I want to do Pascal every day so I can get pieces of uh, mermaid stuff every day. So yeah, another thing for the daily tars. Hooray, more things that I have to do. And sometimes I might, it might be a little hard to find a scallop, so yeah, it's hard. Anyway, um, yeah, it's, it's gonna be a hard new thing. Anyway, I'm gonna do one round of this, and then I'm gonna look for the, yeah, cause it looks like, uh, the villager crafting isn't in the big city, so I'm gonna I'm going to save that part for later. Anyway, check this one time. Nothing. Look for scallop time. And I look so good in this piratey bandana. Swimming with a pirate bandana. Ooh. Okay, so is this it? 
Please say it is it. Please. All right, yesterday Galvar came so we can get a rusted part from the dumpster. You know what? Yeah, wait, let, let's, speaking of the dumpster, that reminded me of the residential service area, which reminded me, let's check our new song. Not new, not new. Wait, I, I said check our new song, but it wasn't new. What I meant to say is check for a new song. Anyway, let's do this. Come on, come on, be, be, ah! Spotted garden meal. Okay, if I find like this, like I don't need to find a scallop every day, but I want to, I mean like the mermaid stuff is good. This could be it. Or it could be not. That's an option too. It could be a moon jellyfish. Ooh, there's something with a... Oh, I thought for a second that it had a lot of bubbles, but no. Not a lot of bubbles. So yeah, this is probably not a scallop. Nope, it's a whelk. Whelk. Like, that's such a weird name. Whelk. Whelk. And, it's, and you know what? It's pretty fun to say, though. Whelk. Welk. Sea star. Sea star. Oh no. Now I'm just saying all the diving creatures name in a weird way. Okay, the rule of three. I have to do it on this third one. Acorn barnacle. Acorn barnacle. <laughs> barnacle. Barnacal. That, that's weird. Ooh, look at that. That is a lot of bubbles. And yet it is seaweed. Hold it! Like, everybody on the internet is saying like there's, like when they do their with how to catches on the Animals they say like there's three size of shadows But you know what? I honestly think that that's not that, that that's not that that's not true and there's actually um like four like Big medium and large, but I also think there's like massive because like Lot uh people are saying like that the giant isopod and the gigas are the same size But I think uh that the gigas is one size bigger. Speaking of gigas, that's a gazami crab. <laughs> Aw, like it wasn't giving me a run for my money, but still. Spiky bro. Uh, I'm not, like the time I want a scallop, I don't find no scallop. Ah, oh, horse. Okay, what is this? Sea pineapple? You know what, I'm gonna, like I call uh, the sea urchins spiky bro, spiky bros. And like I called them like, like I called the sea pineapples like knockoff spiky bros. But you know what, I'm gonna call them yummy spiky bros cause they're pineapple. Oh, whelk, whelk, whelk. Oh, what am I doing? I'm <laughs> like, is there ever a moment where you make yourself mad? Like I'm doing that with all this diving creature nonsense. Ooh, I like how like when you go underwater, the pirate bandana looks like it's wet. Cause it is, but still it looks so satisfying seeing like a sh how shiny it is when it's wet. Ooh, just, I don't know. I just like that. Anyway, that's a that's a good amount of bubbles. Anyway, what are you? 
See, delicious spiky bro, yummy spiky bro. You know what? I don't think I'm gonna find. Um. Uh, this uh scallop. So I'm gonna take a break from that and do my villager crafting. Anyway. Yeah. Also, also while I'm going down this beach, I have to look for. Uh, gold, gold, uh, gold, golden stag guy. Like, sometimes I like to name the creatures. Um, uh, when. Like, I'm going after them other than just, like, golden stag, golden stag. Sometimes I like to, like, properly name them. I don't know how what to name the golden stag. Maybe Goldie. That would make sense, but... Oh, wait. there. I just noticed that's, like, a new lily of the valley up there. Like, we're getting so many lilies of the valleys lately. Again, it's so cool, like, that they're just naturally... Er Sp they naturally spawn around my island. That's just nice. Like, look at them all. They're just so nice. Just sitting there. <laughs> oh, right. That's the whole reason I came over here. To, um, visit Clay's house. And I took the long route, and then I just skip over Clay's house. Like, going on this... <laughs> Like, I made, did the long route, and then I just skipped. What, whatever, I didn't even need to do any of it. Because Clay's not crafting. So it's Sky, the one, who is the one that's crafting. Unless she's sick, which means there could not be a villager crafting, potentially. I really hope there is a villager crafting, because... I like villagers when they're crafting. But only when they're crafting, you know. There! Sorry, I'm in the middle of something right now. What are you up to? I'm crafting a peach dress just to see how I do that. I'm pretty sure I already have one of those. DIY is a great way to learn by doing. I'm totally obsessed with it. Wait, something tells me that you already know how to make a peach dress. I do. I'm not surprised you never fail to impress, Swoopy. You must know a, a do-it-yourselfer out there who wants to learn to make a peach dress. Why don't I give this recipe to you to pass it on to someone who can use it? Okay. Like, it's nice when they say it, like, nicely, but then they, but some people just cram it down your throat and then say, like, do it, do it, give it to somebody else. Anything that encourages crafting a peach dress is worthwhile. Anyway, like, I'm not talking about the peach dress, because there was another peach-themed item that I wanted to craft that I, like, got, I got this peach surprise box a while ago, and I want to craft it. It just looks so peachy, you know. You know what I mean by that? Peachy. Anyway, like, um... I'm going to have to shake my orchard. You know what I just am? Good, oh. Oh, wait, there. Look at that. Hey, wanna see, don't wanna see that leaf dance? Look. Oh, it doesn't dance, it's not dancing? Oh, it, oh, I thought like, I thought they made like a cool dance when they were about to turn into a leaf bug, but no, apparently not. Like, yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna have to shake him. And that's okay, I guess. Ah, oh, it's so annoying, like, they take so long to, 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 uh, regrow. So, I try to avoid shaking my orchard. Yeah, but it's nice to just have some trees of like, 
You know what? I should take my orchard more, because, like, some of these things are useful. That I grow. Oh, and there's a peach tree right here. I guess I get an extra peach. Extra peach for my buck. All right, I need to check for uh, rusted parts. For a rusty parts. Like, there's so much uh, that I'm doing. I'm trying to catch the gold. Oh, yes, a rusted part. Like, this is going to be so much more easy to get the uh, robot hero. Anyway, I, w I just wanted to check so I get my bonus miles. Anyway, yeah, we I can't wait to catch the... To, 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 um, to um, uh, get this peach surprise box. Because it looks so surprising. Like, a while ago, I, w I wanted to craft one. But I didn't really want to shake my orchard. But now I'm okay with shaking my orchard. So, yeah. Let's go inside and craft this baby. Because I thought I saw it needed more materials. Oh, look at this messy inventory. I can eat this peach. You know what? I can just eat it. Um, what's this? Right, this I can put in storage. Wait, do I need anything else for this peach surprise box? Soft wo soft wood. Like, soft wood is so super easy to get. In fact, I have like too much softwood. Like, look at all this. It's good that it needs softwood. Like, f okay, so four softwood. Grab. 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 There. Now I have everything I need to craft this peach surprise box. I don't know really why I want to craft it. It just looks... Wait, whoa, 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 A baby pops out of it? Okay, I'm definitely crafting this thing. It looks... That looks weird. And I like weird. So yeah, pizza prize box. Like, okay. Now, I'm happy I crafted it. I was unsure why I wanted to craft it. I mean, like, it was... It, I mean, it kind of looked weird. What, what, what I'm trying to say is... Now I have a good reason that I crafted it. <laughs> a baby pops out. Okay, where should I place this thing? Oh, I should probably get rid of my net, because, uh... Scorpions are about... At this time. Okay. I want to just test it in here. How about we just test it in here? Okay, what is this? <laughs> that is ridiculous. It makes a funny sound, too. Yeah, that is fun. That is, that is a item. That is a hoot. That is a hoot worthy item. But where should I put this perfectly hoot worthy item? Oh, I have a great idea. I know where it should go. Like, I know the perfect spot for this. Like, it's absolutely perfect. It ap ap it absolutely needs to go in Jack's Park. Like, it's just so perfect. I don't know why, it just looks, it, it would fit in here. Look at, I mean, watch this, like, like, look, this is like the back wall has all the weird items. 
And I think, uh, I, well, not really weird, but like, you know what? I think these horses should go a different way. Like, there. Oh, oh, it's bumper horses. Like, they bump each other. Aw, oh, that's, that's nice. Anyway, like, this is like where all the mysteriously fun items are. So, yeah. Bum, 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 bum. Ooh, hey. Wait, why did I get excited about that? That was just a earth boring dung beetle. I said at the beginning they weren't boring, but you know what? They're boring. Uh, I'm just kidding, they're not boring. I mean, it's cool that they walk on the floor. There are very few bugs that walk on the floor. So that's cool, but um, well, they are, I guess they are kind of boring. I mean, like, common bugs tend to be boring. So, yeah, in this month, uh, there's not much going away. Like, literally, for fit, like, like, every month, like, if you're not caught up, I'm trying to get every model from Flick slash CJ. So I leave out, uh, so like, um, every month I, uh, collect all the bugs slash fish that are going away. So I can, uh, get, get the models from them in advance. So yeah, the two things that are going away this month are the, what's it called, um, thingamabop. No, no, honeybee and tadpole. So yeah, we have a really relaxing month for things going away. Honeybee and tadpole is basically it. But diving creatures don't count because like uh, they 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 can't be turned into models yet. I'm still saving those gigas as giant clamsies for for when that does happen, if it does happen. Anyway. Yeah, I said, like I said, the um, July is relaxing for things going away, but then August comes in, and August is like a nightmare. Like, pretty much everything that came in um, July is going up, is going away after August. Like brown cicada, like cicada shell. Like over here, we have cyclometrists and all the big beetles, like, well, not that guy. But still, there's so much going away after August. I'm worried. Yeah, and having to catch three cicada shells, that will just be fun. That'll be great. You know. Wait a second. Did I just see a bug? I thought I saw a bug. Oh, maybe it's just my flickin' CJ stash, because a lot of these things are bugs. Anyway, oh. Yeah, I should probably end the episode, but. Right, I still need to find a. Whatever it's called. The clam thing. The. T the, um. Uh. Scallop. To get a, uh. Mermaid thing. Or as I like to call it, Maymerd. A maymer thing. Mermaid backwards, maymerd. Well, not every letter, but just like the mer and the maid. Maymerd. Oh no, it's maid mer. Mermaid, maid mer. Mermaid, maid mer. 
Wait, what am I even... You know what? I should just stop. I'm embarrassing myself. Pineapple. Right, I'm doing a video. Fell asleep there, sorry. Oh, moving fast. It's, I think this is a mantis shrimp or a tiger prawn. You know what, I'm kind of thinking tiger prawn because it's like, run for your money speed, kind of. Poil oyster? I didn't know you were, were run for your money. And they used U-turn, and it used a U-turn. It turned like a U. Anyway, what is this? Sea grapes. You know how I feel about sea grapes. I like them. They're, they're, they look good. Ooh, what is this? What are you? You are a tiger prawn. Like, I haven't... I haven't seen one of these since, um, episode 116. And this is episode 127. Wait, did I say 127 at the beginning or did I say 126? I get confused with these things, okay? So, uh... So sorry if I say it wrong. Sometimes. And sorry if the name of the episode, like, has the wrong number. Like, because if, like, like when Assistant's editing my videos, maybe he'll accidentally hear me say the wrong number and think that that's that. I mean, hear me accidentally say the wrong number. Okay. Come on. That's nothing. Ah, oh, it's just a sea grape. Come on. I need a scallop. I need a scallop. I need my scallop. Ooh, there is something with a ton of bubbles. So this could be something rare, or it could be a scallop. Or it could be seaweed. That too. Anyway, what is this? Are you something cool? No, you're a muscle. Well, muscles, I guess, are cool. Well, muscles are very cool, but... Um... Ocean muscles aren't cool. Yeah, this is just another... Something... Moon jellyfish. Let it go. Let it go. That's probably copyright. That's probably copyrighted, so I probably shouldn't sing. Oh god, am I gonna get copyright? <laughs> I mean, am I gonna get like uh, whatever? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, there's so much stuff, and I'm. I just want to go into land to catch uh. I mean, to, not to catch. Like, I want to go into land. You know what? When I get to land, I'm, I'm just going to end the episode. Because, um, uh, because, uh, you know what? I'll just get the scallop off screen. But I don't want to not catch anything just in case it's rare. See, gripes? muscle right releasing this thing I don't think it's worth that much oh you know what no I'm not going for that just seeing all the backs of the trees I mean like the tops of the trees and assistance house Okay. 
You know what? I'll, I kind of want to put some seaweed here. There. And some seaweed about here. How about we just have like two seaweeds here? Oh, I can even see them from outside the water. Wait, I want to check something. Like, if I place down one of these... Oh, it's in a tank. I thought it was going to be in a thing. In like a little pouch. A little pouchy. Wait, that's a huge fish up there. I gotta go for it. Sorry guys, I just gotta go for it. I'm seeing a lot of big fish that I just have to say no to. And that ends now. For I, Jack, will craft a fishing rod. I wish there was a craft app that let you, uh, I wish like after you like crafted like a million things or like a ridiculous number like that. Like they let you um, upgrade your craft app so you could just craft things anywhere. You know what I'd do? I, I would go uh, and uh, do, oh right, fishing rod. I would go uh, manila clam hunting and like craft all those. You know what? Not even manila cram clams. That sometimes that can be hard. If if like I needed a mil to craft a million things, I would just craft like find a very an even easier thing than fish bait, and then craft that. You know what? This looks like an epic catch. I'm gonna craft. I'm gonna catch it from up here. This might not work. Right, this 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 could be a bad idea and it might not work. And it's right. You know what? I can't hear really hear that well from up here. <laughs> so I'm going down like all I can hear are waterfalls. And maybe if I go down here, it'll hear I'll hear less of that. You know what? You know what? Let you know what that that doesn't have any to do with anything. Let's just say the reason I came down here is because it's hard to to uh fish up there. Oh, <gasps> like it's, like all these diving creatures and fish are making the video too long. Okay, what are you? Arapaima. Second time I caught an Arapaima up here. Taking a video of that. Yeah, like, this, like, that spot up there is, like, a perfect spot to catch a lot of fish. Like, I've caught so many rare fish there. Like, three. I caught, like, three rare fish up there. Two Arapaimas. And, uh, Golden Trout. By the way, the... The, 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 the second Arapaima was the one I just caught. <laughs> anyway, I like to end my videos inside the museum. Look, Blathers is like, where are you going to go? Where, which exhibit? Like, he was, like, opening his mouth, like, oh, wait, look. Which exhibit are you going to go to? Which exhibit are you going to go to? Yeah. I'm going to go to the bug exhibit, because I want to watch one monster bug fight before we go. I mean, before we end the episode. So. Whoa! Look at that! Look at that. Show, come on, Rainbow Stag. You can prove yourself. Like, Rainbow Stag has lost, like, every fight. Come on, defeat the Horned Elephant. Like, this is going to be a hard one, but you can still do it. I still believe in you. Come on, Rainbow Stag. Yeah, he finally won a fight. So he couldn't beat, like, he couldn't beat, like, the Saw Stag and all those puny guys, but he could beat a Horned Elephant. Wow. Sorry, sorry, Saw Stag, I called you puny. Anyway, like, I don't think I've ever, 
ended an episode in this bench. I don't even think I've ever sat on this bench. So yeah, let's do that. Oh, look at this. Wait. Look, when you're on your phone, like, it... It gets rid of the tree, and, like, look at all those bugs just standing in midair. Look. That looks... Look at that. <laughs> it looks so weird. Anyway, uh... Yeah. Let, let's end it just here. You, you can't really see my face. Well, you know what? We got the pirate bandana. We need to... We need the pirate bandana to be on screen, I think. Oh, look at that creepy spider. Yeah, I'm dragging this on too long. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode. In the next episode, I think we're gonna go golden stag hunting again! But anyway, thank you for watching this episode, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye! Wave goodbye! Turn off recording. Turn off Audacity in three, two, one. <laughs> hey, awesome viewers. Thank you for watching Jack's Junction. Please like and subscribe. It would really help the channel out. Keep me in awesome. Three claps. Ten seconds on it starts now. Hey cicadas! Quiet down all there! Okay, ten seconds on it starts now.